Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Illustrator CC 2021 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a repeating pattern or a repeating grid as we're now sort of calling it in the Illustrator world. So let me show you how it's done. The first step, I've gone ahead and created three shapes. If you don't know how to create shapes, just go over here to the shape tool, select the shape that you want. In this case, let's select an ellipse and create the shape and that's it. I created three of them and they're three different colors. The next step, I want to select the three in, that are going into the pattern. So I'm going to make a pattern out of these three different shapes. I'm going to go to Object, and I'm going to ungroup them, and then I'm going to group them. Basically, you have to group the objects. I had already grouped them. That's why I ungrouped them. So the first step, Object Group. The next step, we want to go to Object, and then we're going to go down here a little bit, and you're going to see a few options. One of them is Repeat Grid. This is the one we want. It automatically starts to fill out the grid for you, and it basically just shows you what you can do. So I'm going to show you real quickly here. You can increase the amount in the grid. So let's say I wanted it to go to the edge of the red rectangle, and then I want to pull it down. Okay, and I'll go to the edge of that rectangle. So you'll see here we've now created a grid. We can now move these sliders so that we can expand them out or we can contract them depending on, again, what your grid, what kind of look you're going for. I'm just gonna go with a standard one like this. And also you can make a few other adjustments, like I can increase the size of it. You can increase and decrease the number of items in the grid. So you can go way down to like cool looking. That's actually kind of good looking. Or you can go all the way back up to normal, let go, and you'll see that you've now started creating grids and you're adjusting the grids or the patterns as you see fit. In Adobe Illustrator, this is very easy to do now. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Be back soon with some more stuff.